So I wanted to do something a little bit different. I actually kind of want to play a person first, but I also still want to play the original half of the game. So here is the deal, okay? I'm going to play through Half-Life 1, but I'm going to do it in Opposing Forces version of the engine because I thought that would be super... that would be stupid enough that, uh... You know. Nice. This is off to a fantastic start. I'm sure there'll be some weird unexpected behaviour, uh including scientists not talking. This isn't even gonna work. I don't know if this is even gonna work. Oh, it works. Okay, there's just no voice lines. The the noteworthy thing is actually the flashlight. Instead of being a light... Good lord! <laughs> uh, okay. Yeah, it's actually too bright. I actually can't, like, properly see anything when I'm using it, so... Open the door? Oh, you're supposed to be speaking right now, aren't you? I missed the cycle! Are you just not opening the door? Oh, boo. Oh well. I don't understand why this guy's running, though. Okay, some of those lines are still playing. Hey, what's up? <laughs> I'm gonna leave the uh, the pistol out actually so you can see the hands so that uh, anybody who joins the stream gets confused about what the fuck's going on. I knew that was gonna happen. Still went for it. I don't know why I thought I would I'd be able to do that though. Style points. That's the whole reason. Like that. Oh. oh well. I've got another chance. I've got another chance. I've got another chance. I've got another. Ch Holy shit! Why can't I do this? Oh, it's because I'm doing it wrong. Well, I don't know how you actually like do this jump properly. Ah, fuck it. So it's like, what, you shift and then like that? Yeah, except that wasn't enough speed. I'm just gonna do it the other way. Oh well. Yeah, I'm just gonna jump across. I don't care. Up that. Uh, oh, that was awful. Holy shit. I got in the corner. Grab that. C102. Oh, he did the door thing. I always love it when this happens because it, it's fun to see how the window is separate. Okay. I don't understand why the game sometimes crashes there. Let me in. What? Man, did you see that shot? Okay. <laughs> What? Oh, what's that stench? I have a bad feeling what? about this. What? <laughs> what? <gasps> I do not know why that happened. Oh god, I. That's gonna throw me off every time I need to use the light. Is the fact that it's night vision instead? Oh god. This green is awful. <laughs> Yep, that's exactly how that's supposed to work. Let me in. Thank you. Oh. Let me out. Oh my god. I didn't jump. <laughs> what? <laughs> um... I thought I activated something. I did activate something. That's fine. Uh, that's, that's totally fine. Did I ever play Black Mesa version? Uh, I did. I think Black Mesa is fine up until Zen, and then it kind of gets weird. The music for Zen is by far the best bit. Uh, graphically, it's fucking beautiful, except for the visual bugs. Uh, and there are a few visual bugs. Uh, other than that, eh, it's fine. I, I don't really have strong opinions towards it one way or the other. Actually, no, I, I have strong opinions about Zen. That's it. That Zen is kind of 
eh, and not very well designed in Black Mesa, but it's not it's not for me. I, I can say that much. It's kind of the same as um, I would say that Black Mesa is to Half Life what the Resident Evil 2 remake is to Resident Evil 2. Oh yeah, the soundtrack for Black Mesa is fucking incredible. Especially the uh, soundtrack for, for Zen. Fucking, like, the best songs in the game are in Zen alone. But I just, I'm not a huge fan of how it plays. I think there's some very, very simple design problems with it. Very basic design problems with it. Which mostly come down to the sort of puzzle designs more than anything. I, w I would say Black Mesa is Half-Life what Resident Evil 2 Remake is Resident Evil 2. That's not to say either of them are good or bad, they're just very different and I wouldn't directly compare them to the original game because even though they are obviously a different take on the same thing, they're a completely different experience from the original source material. And on that merit, I think Black Mesa is is good, apart from Zen. I just really do not like... I just really do not like Zen, is kind of the, the big thing. I mean, my issues with, with Zen can really be boiled down to the, the puzzle design, really. It kind of encapsulates everything that I find sort of wrong with it. They spend a lot of time doing rule of threes, which, you know, isn't bad, except that they make you do the same thing three times in a row. And it'll be like very slightly different, but like not different enough to the point where, uh, you know, it's like it feels like it's noticeably different. It just feels like I'm doing the same thing again, and now I'm doing it again, and now again, and now we're doing a different puzzle three times, and half the puzzles are just plugging things into a wall, except they're alien plugs. I, I, I don't really und. What the hell? I, I I don't really, really, really like Zen a lot. It just felt like busy work and like, instead of letting you progress, we're going to stop you dead in your tracks and force you to plug three things into a wall and then do it again, I guess. Is the scientist still alive? Holy shit. I'm amazed that he's still alive. I'm not a scientist though, he's security guard. Okay. Like, they just kind of padded it out a lot and it just it felt like padding to me more than anything doesn't change how fucking like beautiful visually it is though and how like insane the soundtrack is for for zen but i just gameplay wise um but yeah like i said i i, I really wouldn't compare black mesa and half-life too much gameplay wise they are completely different <laughs> they're the same locations it's the same story they change basically everything else uh, including the design of like 99% of the locations. Uh, they are clipping through the ground. Uh, okay. Um, yeah, they don't work properly. Huh. What on earth is that? Why are they like disjointed from where they should be? I guess something changed in the code, but like why? Give me trip mines. That's not the right one. Which one is it? I mean, I only need two, right? That's two. Oh, fuck it. I'm just gonna leave it. Wait, you can't jump on them in this, can you? Oh, no, they patched that in this. Wait, they patched it in Opposing Force. Fuck. Um. You know what I can do? I can explosion jump. Damn it. <laughs> this is dumb, but it's an option. <laughs> yeah, this is dumb, but uh, it's an option, so. Who needs to. Uh... <laughs> Who needs to stand on the trip mines anyway? I might die here, but we'll see. Yeah, because I'm going to start taking a lot of damage from this. This might not actually be doable. Yeah, wow, they might have actually, like, patched it, like, legitimately. No, I think I'm not getting enough height there. I think I must be so further this way. Yeah, like that. <laughs> okay, right, that, that should be enough. Developing the new skip for Powered Up, because the regular one isn't enough. Well, uh, okay. You can jump out of that water. You can't normally do that in, half in the best game. I can't. I can't. 
at him. Oh my god, what the fuck? There we go. <laughs> I'll, t I'll take a hit for that, I don't care. Honestly? Solid run, I would say. Solid playthrough. More head grabs? Why are you facing the corner, friend? I missed the head. Oh my god. I missed the head again. Oh, please. There we go. Right. <laughs> I don't know how I'm missing so much. And it's because it's further to the right as well than I thought I was. Wow, it's a double click? Right click? It's a right click. Okay. I thought that was a left click for some reason, but no, it is a right click. Yeah, like that. I'm gonna take down. I'm gonna lie to you. Right to your face. I guess I could have taken the sexual charges, but this is this is obviously Half-Life Posing Force, but Adrian Shepard goes fucking postal. Uh we're gonna watch the rocket again. Look at it go. Look at it go. I'm still worried that at some point I'm gonna run into some kind of problem where um, the change between Opposing Force and Half-Life makes this unplayable. Like some kind of enemy isn't gonna work correctly or some kind of uh, important trigger isn't going to- I'm sorry, what? I mean, that's not like important. <laughs> There's been a bunch of like minor bugs that have that have popped up, but uh, you know that's that's not that's not game breaking like game breakingly bad. It's just kind of amusingly bad. Actually, no, I want to stand from here, don't I? And then it's like that, yeah. And then it's like that. And then skip this whole section because who wants to actually play this game? But they paid money for. Hey, G man, how you doing? Oh, well, I missed. I missed twice. Oh, I didn't miss twice. It just didn't make a noise. <laughs> Why are you up here? Why are you up here? Why are you up here? Please leave. That was actually a really clean jump. I'm surprised I made it into that pipe and like kept as much speed as I did. Oh, what do I want to do? I want to see if I already do title two. See if I for title two. See if I for title two. That's the one. want to throw you up there and kaboom. That hit me. Oh yeah. Oh. That somehow blows up the thing. I didn't actually notice that. Oh, I've got to do this again. What? Why are you still... What? Uh, I mean, sure, but... I don't understand why they uh, just stood there. Okay, so I want to use a shot right here. Nope. Right here? Oh my god, right here. <laughs> oh my fucking god. There, there we go. That's where I want to use it. <laughs> you ready for this? Nope. Why am I sliding down so far? You ready for... Uh, one health. Yeah, planned. Exactly what I wanted. Uh, right. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. See, this is this is where I normally use the crossbow right here, just just because this area is so wide and open that it kind of actually works for it. Like there aren't many other places in the game where I really think the scope is needed, but you know, it's nice to have here. And then you just blast that guy in the face. Boop, 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 boop. Uh, there we go. <laughs> also, I'm uh, I'm going to ruin ruin this for everyone forever. There's a very noticeable seam right here in the skybox. Uh, I don't know how well that shows up on stream. It shows up pretty well on my monitor, but yeah, you can maybe notice it there a bit better. <laughs> There's a pretty noticeable seam in this skybox. Uh, yeah, it's on the other side as well. I feel like this is a different texture, or at least it feels different. I don't feel- I feel, I feel, I feel like there aren't lines in it, in the original game. What is happening up there? Has that- has that always been there and I've just never noticed? Okay, this map is getting ruined the more- the more time I spend looking at it. Did he just place a grenade? No, now he placed a grenade, or threw a grenade, whatever, same thing. Oh my god, aim punch, suck a dick. Stop moving, please. Oh my god, I'm just bad. 
I, I can blame M punch all I want. I'm just bad. <laughs> oh, the M punch definitely did fuck up my uh, my revolver shots on the first guy. I did that last time. Don't fucking hit the explosive crit. You think I'd learn at some point, right? You think I'd learn that hitting explosive crits is a bad idea? But. What? What? But... What? 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 <laughs> um... Okay. Hey, you wanna see a cool trick? <laughs> I'm gonna do it again. There we go. Weird, that box didn't actually give me anything, it just kind of bled. Not really sure what's wrong with it. Wait. I can't jump off these. Wait. Wait, I can't jump off these. Um. Do I actually have to do the puzzle correctly? Wait, no, 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 no. Don't tell me I have to play the game. Don't tell me I have to actually play the game. Oh, no. Oh yeah, fuck, no, fuck playing the game, just do a crouching sideways jump through the trip mines. Fuck you. I'm too skilled. I have no clue how hard that is. I'm gonna pretend that's really difficult. Like, I think it's accents that it has trouble with. Cause I, I noticed it with the um the automated captions on YouTube videos as well. Like with um sort of, you know, very sort of standard American accents, uh, it can normally like caption it pretty well. But when it comes to like British accents, it kind of struggles <laughs> a lot in some cases. Yeah, if I just spoke the same accent as the people that created the uh, the algorithm, then it would it would be fine, and I wouldn't have any issues. It's my own fault for not being born American, and with one of the specific accents that it's good at actually transcribing. That, oh, fucking aim punch sucks dick. I'm gonna do this room again now. Miss. Oh, okay. That actually wasn't M punch. That was just me being bad. How did I miss that? Let me M punch. Oh, M punch fault. Every time I miss, it's M punch. Every time. I should be using. <laughs> what a throw! I should be using like crossbow bolts then instead of revolver. I guess this box fucking sucks because you take damage when you drop onto it. Like that. <laughs> So if you have one health, you can't survive this bit. Okay, right. Back to back to sort of saying saying things about black, like things that Black Mister does weirdly. This puzzle, this room is kind of the same, except that it's not really. It's a little bit different. Um, but the the thing that's notable, because they they change up they change up the place you have to go and stuff. The thing that's notable is that they added a bit where you have to pull a valve, sort of like that. But. Uh, Instead of the valve already being on the thing, it's like, like the thing is like down here somewhere, and like there's like a slot where a valve will go, and then the valve is over there. So instead of just using the valve and carrying on, you have to walk over there first, and then carry the valve over here. And <laughs> oh, that's interesting. Why wasn't it just on there to begin with? Like, why do I have to? Why am I being forced to do this? And in the um. A better example, in the uh, freezer, at the start of the game with the switch that you pull to start the um the sort of lift thing moving. Um, they, they did the same thing there. There's a valve that you have to turn, and as you turn it, it moves it back and forth. Uh, but for some reason, the valve isn't on it by default. So you're like, oh, where's the valve? You take two steps to the right, and there's the valve on the floor for no reason. A lot of their puzzles kind of just devolved into, instead of having this thing that you interact with just be a thing that you interact with, let's take the valve off of the thing and put it like five meters somewhere else and then force you to put it on there first. And it feels really weird. <laughs> and I just, I don't know why they did it like that. Also, I know the, the health thing is there, but I'm gonna ignore it. I do not like the puzzle design in Black Mesa. That's my real issue with it. Die, you blood sucker. But this voice line is normal. The rest of his voice lines are missing, but that one was there. Okay, so there should be two guys down here, I think. Or just one. You. No, it's fine, because look, I'm about to get more health. There we go! See? Look at that. Look at that number. 255! Ah. That's fine. It's this one. Jump over that. Jump up here. And then... That was too much height. 
I went outside the map. <laughs> yeah, you don't get as much hope from explosives with armor. Like, if I do it now, you see I go much lower than last time. I guess I could just do that to get rid of the armor. <laughs> yeah, that works. Perfect bunny hop to go along with it. Classic elevator skip. <laughs> wow. I'm getting completely, completely stuck in the air. This isn't fun. Don't you... What is that noise? What is that noise? Oh my god, fuck off. <laughs> that noise is awful. c 3 a 2 dial. Fuck off, right? Uh, sure, that works. Probably that way? Which, actually, which way do you want to go? I don't remember. This way? It is this way. <laughs> you leave! <laughs> Oh, they live through two of those. Let me in. Let me in. Let me in. Yeah, so normally you'd have to fuck around with these. Where is the ladder, even? It's up there. Oh, it's up there. Oh, that'll be why I missed it in that one stream then. Okay, I might have to do some... Some advanced... Yeah, I might have to do some... Do multiple, multiple explosions for this. Oh, well. <laughs> yeah, that works. <laughs> All right, let's keep going. What is it? It's like that, and then it's it's what is two, I think. And then it's I think seven. No, it's si five, isn't it? It's, oh fuck, I know seven's right. I think. Uh, maybe four actually. Uh, okay, it's four, and the last one's seven, I think. Yeah, this part does suck because you actually have to do that correctly and it, there's no indication of which one is correct. So you can spend way too long just going through that area, guessing portals until you actually get the right ones. Like this chapter, if you have no clue what you're doing, is probably the longest chapter. Or the most tedious one, anyway. Um... Hey guys, uh, <laughs> hey guys. <laughs> you gonna let me in? I might have to no clip. Well, I'm amazed that you can get this far without needing, uh, without, without the game breaking, actually, to be fair. Those two. What? Why are there two shotguns? The, uh, the texture is actually different, uh, on the shotgun that the scientist, scientist has. And I think that's because this is actually, uh, like, an early version of the shotgun texture, is what it is. But they just never updated it for the, um, for this specific model in the final game. Yeah, this cutscene is never gonna play out, because I can't actually get in, like, properly. I think it's just, I think the sequence is just broken, so... Can I open this? No, I'm gonna have to knock with them. Oh, grab that, and then through here, and then this should be fine, I think. This should be fine from here. Yeah, the door closed, so... Um, what? What are you... Wait, hold on, this is a long... Oh, no, hold on, because I don't have space bound. Ah, oh, shit. What? Does the long jump module not work? What? Hold on. I definitely... Yeah, I definitely took it. Uh, interesting. Give item... Is it a long jump? Interesting. Okay, this is gonna get a lot harder. I'm actually gonna have to, like, manage my grenade usage, because that's the only way I'm gonna be able to get around. Yeah, like that. <laughs> okay. Uh, right, well, now comes the fun part. How the fuck am I supposed to do this? I guess I can... Okay, so I... Yeah, I don't have long jump. I guess I can throw that. Okay, like that. And then down there. And then down there, and that should be fine. Yeah, I didn't take any more damage from that one. I'm surprised the long jump module doesn't work, though. Wait, I can't use my SMG grenades for this. I guess I can turn off the laser, right? I'm keeping the laser on. Hold on, so where's the bit of the floor that breaks, right? It's over here, right? It's like here, because I know you can break this yourself. Yeah, it's right- I wonder where it is. 
There we go. Passive ascending. Go neck lives. <laughs> what is this texture even? It's like a mechanical, like. Manus? Manta ray, sorry, not Manus. Manta ray. Similar words. I do not have. I still have too much armor. Uh, this is gonna be a problem. I guess I can just do this. Okay, never mind. I'm gonna do that differently. And then it's up here. And then it's up somewhere up here. Um, this is right, actually. I went the right way. C4E1, E title. Why does why do each of these maps have a title? <laughs> That's really weird. I'm pretty sure all these maps don't actually have like a title, like separate titles. Uh bottle? I missed it. <laughs> that would have been like a first try bottle. Uh, and then we have C4E3 title. Wait, I'm doing that wrong. I need to blow up the things first. Actually, wait, where's the thingy? Ah, shit. Those balls do a lot of damage as well. There we go. Why? Is there another one? I hate you. Right, don't do it again. I hate you so much. Three in a row? And then just throw some snacks in there? Yeah? Yeah, throw some snacks in there? <laughs> cool. Right, well, um... <laughs> there we go, the snacks did it for me. Good. Thanks, snacks. You're my best friend. That felt... Not that bad. I was expecting Zen to be worse because I just didn't have the long jump module, but like SMG grenades came through more than enough. And now we just get an awkward uh awkward stare down. The boids. Why are they like untextured? Did they remove the textures for the boids in this? In opposing force? I guess they might have done. Anything we're we're here for or uh You're uh, you're too awkward to 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 ask to ask anything? That's fine. Yeah, I'll just, uh, just go up here. I'm disabled, obviously, so... I want to see what the ending text says. Wait, hold on. If I... Can I... I can turn on night vision before I go through. Oh! <gasps> he's there! He's there! The man! The G-man! Um... And Shepard stood there. Wait, was there a text? Was there a, like... A job accepted text? Uh... X. <laughs> it just says X. Bad ending. Half-Life opposing force. Yeah, this was opposing force. Valve is. Randy Pitchford. Valve is Randy Pitchford? I don't think that's true. Gabe Newell? Okay, that's that's true. Doug Lombardi, that's true. Harrius Robbins, that's true. Mike Shapiro? John St. John? Wait, John St. John was... John St... The, the, the voice of Duke Nukem? I'm not mistaking that, am I? That's John St. John. Yeah, I think that first list is Gearbox, and then the second list is Valve, and then the third list is voice actors? Oh, Dwight T. Barnes. Wait, that was John St. John? My suggestion to you is to get your ass down I can kind of hear, I can kind of hear John St. John in this, now that I'm, like, aware... ASAP. Now move it, Corporal. ...aware this was him. No way I would have guessed that without being told. That's insane. Thank you very much for joining me through, uh... What was effectively just a normal Half-Life playthrough, except for the bit where I had to use SMG grenades to get around Zen. Uh, really not that different, to be honest. I thought there'd be more to it. And then I guess Lambda Car kind of broke as well. So I had to knock through the door. But 